Hello great people, welcome back to our channel. We are so excited to have you again. Just like uh, my colleague has said some time ago that Wiki has given the federal government and also FIRS a serious uh, upper court when it comes to income generation. I think that uh, that step by Wiki is sustained right now considering the fact that he has had a meeting with oil, the, all the oil company. And this is a serious one considering the fact that uh, uh, they have been one of the major contributors when it comes to value-added tax in Nigeria. And uh, with what is going to what you're going to hear right now is a pointer to the fact that I income-wise, um, River State is already restructured. And uh, let's see what will happen in the nearest future. But then let's look at what he has to tell all the business people in the state, especially those who are into oil business we're going to give you full details of this in a jiffy but if you're not subscribed to our channel just hit the red subscribe button and also the bell icon so that you get notification anytime we publish our videos all right let's look at the news in detail the river state governor here some week on wednesday insisted on going on with his move to stop the federal government from collecting value-added tax from the oil rich south south state Wiki, who said he does not care if heaven falls insisted that river's money is not meant for abuja people but for the development of his state the government spoke at a stakeholders meeting in port harcourt their state capital while addressing shell petroleum development company and other representatives of oil companies and business owners in the states it has earlier been reported that the federal high court sitting in port harcourt in its judgment last month in a suit marked FHC stroke PH stroke CA stroke 149 stroke 2020 held that the River State government has the power to collect VAT within its territory. The Federal Inland Revenue Service on Monday prayed the court to stay execution on the judgment, but the presiding judge, Justice Stephen Palm, rejected the application, saying granting it would negate the principle of equity. On Monday, the Lagos State Government told the part of River State as a bill to empower it to call it VAT scale second reading in the State House of Assembly. VAT is a consumption tax paid when goods are purchased and services are rendered. It is charged at a rate of 7.5%. Speaking at a stakeholder meeting on Wednesday, televised live on Channel TV and two other stations, Wiki lamented about the injustice in the country, saying River generates 15 billion naira in June 2021, but got 4.7 billion naira. But Kanu produced 2.8 billion in June, but Kanu also got 2.8 billion. Something you don't want to believe these things exist. He said, Sometimes you don't want to believe these things exist. The government. Oh, sorry, the governor said he cannot continue to beg federal government for what belongs to his state. According to him, he said, people say that let heaven not fall, but sometimes I believe that heaven should come down so that everybody will rest. When we do the right thing, heaven is at peace. So the right thing must be done at all times, he said. Wiki further added that River State is challenging FIRS from collecting VAT in River State, but not challenging FIRS from collecting VAT in Abuja. Let it be understood, but the law says River must collect VAT in the state. The federal government sur surreptitiously lobbied to amend the constitution to place VAT collection under the exclusive legislative list. We have challenged it and we have no apologies to anybody. I don't want to be in the good books of anybody but in the good books of God, you don't bully state like us. If I are, I should be very careful. I have the political will to do a lot of things. If they continue to bully us, I would take all these their offices in the state. Hmm. The governor warned the oil companies and business owners not to remit their VAT to FIRS, but the river state government. According to him, he said, I don't want you to fall prey of the people who think they can use force to take our money. If you want to take advantage and say you don't know who to pay to, it is a lie. You know, from this September, we will start collecting our VAT. We will not look back, but seal up the 
premises of such companies wiki ones man this is serious you know we've been talking about this issue of restructuring for so long but some state governors now that they understand uh, that they have executive uh, order has the executive right to make some decision, they are taking the restructuring for themselves. Because when you look at the issue of restructuring, I think um, the first, the topmost uh, importance of it for some state is the issue of income generation. I need to control my income, and, and it's overly important. And that's what Wiki just did right away. And um, now that uh, Lagos State is aligning, they are also joining with the you know restructuring stuff. Because I, I believe that if all of these guys begin to, you know, um, kind of take their monies that ought to go to the federal government, uh, it may force the federal government at a point when they notice that monies are not coming in as expected, it may force them to tell the state, begin to take care of your expenses. I've restructured. Begin to take care of your expenses. You know, he just uh, make a reference to um, Kano State, that as much as $15 billion was generated by River State in the month of June. And all what they got was just, I think, 2 point something million or 5 point or 7 point something million. But in the case of Kano State, they made $2.8 million and $2.8 million was given to them. So, uh, but the the only thing is that it may impact negatively on other states who are folding their hands to always look up to the federal government to give them money. You understand? Because uh, I, I feel that everyone ought to start looking inwards right now. I'm, I'm already foreseeing restructuring coming in. You know, because when it gets to a point where the federal government cannot do so much when it comes to helping out the states, you know, to collect everybody's fund and then you know from there begin to share it they may call for restructuring to help them because uh, the honors have been on them for too long and uh, it has not been helping matters. It has made some state governors to be totally dormant. That's why you see some huge rush for, you know, um, entering the office of a governor. Some people don't even have a plan. You know, they just walk into that office and they begin to operate based on um, monies that they get from federal government and all of that, from federation account and all of that. But uh, when it, when restructuring takes place, you know, you will begin to look out for different avenues to generate income for your state. You begin to hold some persons responsible and you begin to take the issue of insecurity seriously because uh, for some of these guys that are just enjoying themselves and pretending as if there's no in in insecurity in their state, it's because you're getting money from the federation account. But by the time you know that people need to enter forests, you need to start explore, exploring your state to ensure that you get enough money, you know, so that you can take care of uh, some of the expenses that are coming to you via your office as a governor. You will notice that this issue of bandits and all of that, it will be dealt with. Even these full and guys who are enjoying themselves, uh, no, we don't even know if they pay VAT on their cows and all of that. When, it, uh, when it's time, everything will be well structured. Every state will begin to structure businesses in the state. And I, I mean, this guy is now only talking about the uh, the issue of uh, oil companies and all of that. You know, the banks also, they charge VAT on people who make transactions on 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 um, a monthly basis. If you check your account, you will notice that at the end of the month, there are some stipends. Now it has been increased to 7.5%. Before now it was 5%, but it has been increased to 7.5%. So if they start turning their eyes to look at also banks, it therefore means money realized by the uh, Federal Indian Revenue Service will really go down a great deal. I, I, I don't know. The, the, if the federal government would not fight it at a point, because by the time they start noticing that what is coming to the federation account via different channels like FIRS and the likes is reducing, automatically it may force them to start uh, uh, calling remote control the um, judicial system so that they can get back what they feel rightly belongs to them. There have been multiple reactions to it. And uh, right now, Gombe State, I think the commissioner in Gombe has also talked about the issue of uh, River State understanding that they, we are all brothers. So be your brother's keeper, a kind of, is now the words that they are using. But I feel that the step taken by Wiki is, for me, very divine. Very divine because it, it will wake some people up. Some states will 
watch themselves generating one point something million naira, and how would you be able to pay all the, the, the debts and everything that you have been, you know, enjoying thus far? It, it will wake them up to start looking for possible avenues to generate revenue. I'd like to leave it there. Do you think that the step taken by Governor Wiki is the right one in the right direction, or do you think also that it is restructuring in disguise? Let's interrupt.